Hi guys, I have started answering the questions, I've started making videos, answering the questions that you guys have been asking so that uh, when the questions come up, I can refer I to a specific video instead of being the same thing over and over again. I don't mind doing it, but I think if I make a video and I put more information in it, then it would be beneficial to you. You could go ahead and watch the video and get the information from the video instead of me typing a few words and then uh, it's not really clear, it's not concise and you're not getting too much from it. So I thought I would go ahead and start a series by answering questions that you ask very frequently. So the question that I'm addressing today is how do I get rid of bumps on my locks? Bumps on your locks means that your locks, they are not smooth. So that can be caused by many different things. The first thing is that maybe when you twist your hair, uh, you don't twist it properly and so it leaves bulges at the root. And so when it starts growing out, it then it becomes very bumpy. And the way you can combat that is by when you twist your hair, go ahead and also palm roll it as well. From the root all the way to the end, palm roll it. And that will combat any bumps or unevenness on here. And also another thing is that when you have new growth, if you don't twist them onto your fully formed locks, then you can experience some amount of bumps because when that hair start locking on its own freely and it's not uh, trained to lock a certain way, then it will cause bumps and then it will make your lock very uneven and bumpy. So what you can do is go ahead and when you twist, first what you need to do is to twist on that new growth onto your fully formed locks then go ahead and palm roll from the roots to the ends i know it's a lot of work but i can guarantee you that you will have beautiful locks. The next thing that um what that can contribute to your hair being too bumpy if is you, do not interlock it properly if you interlock your hair and it splits sometimes it tends to uh, make your hair bumpy when it grows out and so to avoid that is when you interlock your hair try not to push the needle through the same hole try to go through another hole or a different hole so some people they, they do west north south east west north south east but for me i don't do that all i do i ensure that i do not go through the same hole and i do not interlock my hair that often so I have a chance I do experience it because I do my interlocking myself so sometimes I may have them splitting and I don't show the ones in the back so all I do is I ensure that I palm roll my hair uh, religiously so that if I do have that happening in the areas that I can't see then the palm rolling combat that also, you can do if your hair is bumpy. As I said before, the good old palm rolling. And also, you could go ahead and trim your locks. So, if you have thick enough locks, go ahead and use a scissors and trim off some of it. Just clip it. And then, don't do it all at once because then chances are you may damage your hair. You may clip off too much and then your hair starts getting thin and then it will start breaking so what you want to do is to clip off a little at a time until you get the desired thickness or other parts of your locks so it's pretty simple palm rolling and also trimming if needs be. another thing why your locks can get bumpy is that you put some form of hair accessory on it so lock jewelry and when you put lock jewelry on your locks it tends to make parts of your locks thin and so depending on how many you put on your locks then you can have very thin so thin section thin section thin sections and then these thin sections will make the thicker section appear as bumps and so that can be very um, dangerous and so what I suggest you do is if you wear lock jewelry Take them out before you go to sleep. Don't wear them for very long periods of time. And you might be saying, how can I prevent this from happening if I already have it? So what you can do is palm rolling. Palm rolling is the key. And try to twist on your 
uh, new growth onto your fully formed locks that is very important as well try to remove your lock jewelry before bed at night don't sleep with them don't wear them for a prolonged period of time because that tend to weaken your hair contribute to your hair breaking as well so I would recommend when you twist your hair palm roll when you interlock your hair palm roll as well because interlocking alone will Perfect. not bumps from growing on your hair so what you'll need to do is to interlock as well as palm rolling so if you follow those very simple steps then you will have beautiful smooth locks so thank you so much for watching if you have any questions remember to leave them in the comment box below or send me an email at syne t-h-i-a-e at gmail.com or leave me a question on my facebook fan page or on twitter and thank you so much for watching you go ahead and have yourself a wonderful day and i'll see you next time bye